With the return of summer heat to the forecast, a reminder now that high temperatures can impact the effectiveness of your medicines and your body's ability to stay cool. Meteorologist Nick Kelly breaks it all down. Even though we enjoyed our dip into the 70s and 80s over the past several days, summer heat will return starting this weekend. It's something that a local pharmacist is familiar with and not looking forward to. I, I run a lot and when you run in the mornings if it's already 80 degrees when you're running it's pretty miserable so on those days it's going to be 90s and 100 degrees it gets pretty unbearable first thing in the morning even though he takes it in stride he encourages those with certain medications to take it easy as the heat returns while not all medications can impair your body's ability to sweat and cool down some surprising medications like beta blockers can a beta blocker, a drug that ends in OLOL. -L. Um, those are for blood pressure or heart. Those also make you not sweat as much. So then you would be more susceptible to like a heat of, of some sort. Plus, anyone treating their depression or OCD with medications like Prozac, Zoloft, or Sertraline can have problems with the heat. They can cause you to, you know, have some fluid type issues like shifting into different spaces and cause you to have the, the heat issues. People on these types of medications and others like antihistamines can take additional steps like hydrating more frequently, applying more sunscreen before heading back outside and taking frequent breaks in either the shade or air conditioning. Plus, it's important your medication is stored properly, not inside your car. You think I'm just going to go in and go grocery shopping for an hour. You know, that's an hour that they're sitting at 100 degrees. Those pills in that bottle are going to start, you know, breaking down. They're going to start not working as well. Medications, whether in liquid or pill form, are best kept stored in a cool and dry place in your home, like a dresser drawer, a closet, or kitchen cabinet away from sources of heat and moisture. With these tips in mind, you and your medicine can beat the heat that is eager to return. Reporting for KY3 News. I'm Nick Kelly.